This video review will cover how to complete message banking and upload to your MyMessageBanking.com account all on your iPhone. We're going to look at downloading the AVRX or Awesome Voice Recorder app from the App Store. At the time of this recording, the version demonstrated is version 2.0.6. You will see a visual of appropriate distance of phone to mouth, discuss recording environments. We're going to set up and demonstrate use of the AVRX app on your iPhone through graphics, and then discuss downloading the recordings to mymessagebanking.com from that same phone. When you go to the App Store, this is the icon you'll see for AVRX voice recorder. To set the stage, when you are using the recorder, you'll hold the phone up to six inches away from your mouth as visualized here. And note that if you're moving your hands or adjusting your grip while recording, it will negatively impact the outcome. The recording environment is also really important. You want to be in a quiet recording space and know that fans, air conditioners, refrigerator no noises, other environmental sounds will be picked up. You want to make sure that you're not in a space where there is an echo when you're recording. Avoid recording in the breeze or uh, in the wind as the blowing sound will distort the recording. Avoid recording in the car as road noises will impact quality. And know that moving your hands, adjusting your grip while recording will negatively impact the outcome. All that being said, when one is message banking, you should record anything you want when you want but understand that the quality may be diminished depending upon the situation the good thing is once it's recorded even with poor quality you can go back and re-record it later when you open the app you will see a screen that looks like this first let's make sure you have the right settings so if you tap the cog icon now let's make sure your settings are the same as these. And you can adjust these settings by using the left and right caret arrow. You want the file format to be WAVE, encode quality medium, sample rate 44 100 hertz, the bit rate 128, and channels stereo. Now tap here so you can go back. And now you're ready to start recording. Tap the red circle to start recording. Know, however, that if you delay speaking after you tap the red button, your message will have dead space at the start. So be prepared to speak once you've tapped the red circle. When you've completed the message, tap here to end the recording. You can now go back and forth repeatedly between these two, starting, recording, and ending, until you've recorded all of the messages you wish to do at the time. When done, touch this icon in the bottom left corner. It will take you to this page. Select Default, and this is where all your recordings are stored. To listen to the recording, just touch the desired recording. You'll see that that recording now is grayed out, and the sound file appears here below. Tap here to listen to that recording. When you then decide what you want to upload to mymessagebanking.com, tap here. You may then select the recordings you wish to download. And if you'd like to select all of them, you could do that as well. In fact, we recommend uploading and saving everything frequently, as it is possible that when your phone does an automatic upgrade, it may delete the files. You then may select the recordings you wish to download. When you've selected all you want, tap the Upload icon. It will take you to this screen. And note that you may have to scroll down on your screen to reveal the Save to Files command. Select that command, and it will take you to this screen. My folder is empty, yours may not be, but we want to create a folder specifically for your banked messages. To do that, select the icon with the three dots, 
then select New Folder. Then you can title that folder. I'm going to call mine Message Banking. I then select Save, and it will upload all of your messages and then quickly take you back to this screen. Okay, now let's look at the actual upload to MyMessageBanking.com. In order to allow you to import your audio files to MyMessageBanking.com, please do the following. Go to Settings on your iPhone, scroll down and select Chrome, turn on Allow Cross-Website Tracking. If you don't have Chrome, we suggest loading that as MyMessageBanking.com performs best in Chrome. Now go to your browser in Chrome and upload MyMessageBanking.com. When you sign in, note that you should be doing this on the same device that you recorded in the AVRX app. When you open your account, you can select Upload. Tap on each message you wish to upload to MyMessageBanking.com. And note you could also upload all by tapping on the Select All icon. A blue check mark will appear on the selected messages. And when you've selected all that you wish to upload, tap Open. You'll then see those messages appear in the screen. If you select Start, it will begin transcribing those. You'll see a progress report as it's being completed, and then it will tell you Upload is complete. You may now view the messages and the transcription by tapping the View My Messages. Note that currently you cannot listen to the recordings on the phone. You need to go to your browser on your computer and open your MyMessageBanking.com account in Chrome so you can listen to those recordings there. For any further information, please feel free to be in touch with us.